Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about combining like terms, and we want to simplify each expression. So, if I was given this expression, negative 2x plus 11 plus 6x. So, negative 2x plus 11 plus 6x. All right, so if I want to combine these terms, well, I'm going to rearrange this, okay? And by rearranging it, since it's all addition, I can use that uh, by the commutative property. And I'm going to put my variables first and my numbers second. So I have the negative 2x out here, plus bring the 6x over here, and then plus the 11 at the end. Since there's no other uh, number, so uh, the plus 11 is really by itself there. So now let's combine the like terms. Well, our variables, right, we can combine them. So now we have negative 2x plus uh, 6x. If we're good with this, we can realize that it's going to be 4x, all right? But if it might be easy for you to see, um, I'm going to rearrange this to be 6x plus a negative 2x plus 11. And adding a negative is the same thing as subtraction, so 6x minus 2x plus 11. And now, hopefully it's easier to see, 6x minus 2x is just 4x. And the whole time I'm bringing down the plus 11 because there's no other like term to add it to. And now our final answer is 4x plus 11. So let's recap. Negative 2x plus 11 plus 6x, I rearrange using the commutative property our like terms. I put the 6x next to the uh, negative 2x, and I brought the plus 11 to the right. Well, if we at this point can realize that negative 2x plus 6x, that's something we might be able to add together and have this 4x, great, fantastic, you can go to the bottom. But if you can't, it's okay. We need to rearrange, again, using the commutative property to write 6x plus a negative 2x. And adding a negative 2x is the same thing as subtraction, so we rewrite this as 6x minus 2x. And now that should be easier to see, that 6x minus 2x is 4x, while the whole time bringing down the plus 11. And so our final answer here is 4x plus 11. 